Okay, let's look at Lowe's here. Let's see what they have to offer for t tool deals. A lot of craftsman stuff, shirts and hats. They're really going all in on this craftsman thing here at Lowe's. Got the tape measures, power tools. A lot of the power tools, I think, are just rebranded Porter Cable tools and DeWalt tools. Just my opinion. That's what it looks like. Hand tools here. Screwdrivers, pliers. Basically all their hand tools are not made in the USA, most of them. Kind of disappointing. Some power tools there. I've heard that they are planning to make more hand tools in the USA if, once they get their plants uh, up and going. I don't know if that's just speculation at this point, but it's yet to be seen. More power tools. Oscillating uh, blades, oscillating tool, flashlights, a lot of bit kits. And again, guys, I apologize, not the best camera work in the world. And things don't come up quite as clear with the wide angle lens here on my camera, but it kind of helps to get everything uh, in frame, see everything. Some of those flashlights are pretty cool. So it's like a power bank, USB rechargeable, pretty cool. This is a good deal here on some drill bits, $9. I think it's to the 28th, November 28th, 2018. So you have like a day or so to pick that up for that price. Router bits, this look pretty good. Some gloves, waterproof gloves, some pretty cool gardening type of gloves. Cobalt uh, mechanics kits, a lot of those. Cobalt uh, bit kits, has a lot of the specialty bits that you might need. Torques, security torques, all that stuff. It's a good kit to have. Cobalt uh, driver kit, cobalt pliers, wrenches there, more pliers, knives, five bucks, more bits, cobalt uh, kit here, 129 drill driver and uh, impact driver, this looks like uh, the good deal, that's the more uh, high end high-end kit there that has multiple speeds I think on the impact driver they have an impact driver that doesn't have multiple speeds cobalt uh, power tools are pretty good bits this bit kit's pretty handy it's different this year the driver on this they changed the the end on it doesn't look as good in my opinion, but still a good kit to have. Nice little compact kit. There's a lot of specialty bits in there. It's a nice socket kit down here. Good to keep in the car. It's like 25 bucks, I think. More pliers. I think these pliers are ten dollars as well. Till the twenty eighth, twenty eighteen. Pneumatic kit with the compressor, nailers. Seems like a good deal. Craftsman toolboxes here. It kind of looks like we're in Sears now. Testing out the soft close feature on these. I always like to do that. It's always kind of fun. <laughs> I always like to play with that. The red and black looks pretty cool. We got the cabinet.
72 bucks here. Probably towards the 28th. To the 28th. T stack. Got the kit. I think it's made in the USA as well. Kind of nice compact little storage kit. Trying out this uh, handle there. Try to see how uh, cheesy it is. Because you, as long as you don't overload the stuff, it should be fine. Seems like a cool thing. Thing, the thing with Lowe's, you gotta walk throughout like the whole store, like in the back, to keep a lot of this stuff as well. Cordless uh, circ saws and corded ones, miter saws, flashlights here. Screwdrivers, cheap uh, tin snips, ten bucks, three pack. Cobalt uh, impact wrench. I did a review on it. That is very powerful, but kind of big, but has a lot of power. This uh, cabinet, worktop cabinet, looks pretty cool. Storage on the side, sock close. So it has a nice locking feature. It's a nice wood top. Pegboard is metal, 500 bucks. Pretty cool. This looks good too. Nice black looks good. Seven hundred bucks. Cobalt inflator, forty-five bucks. What I notice about Lowe's, a lot of the prices like vary by store and by region. So, some not on, not on old things, but some things. Linux tools here. Linux tools are pretty good. They got this. This is a new tool they uh, brought here. It's like a multi uh, nut driver. It's magnetic. Has all those sizes. Pretty cool. I think I might actually get this. Especially since it's magnetic. That's uh, that's that's good. Fifteen bucks. Tin snips. Reset blades, whole sauce. See, if you didn't go in the back of the store, you wouldn't know they had those tools. So you don't have a display like that up front. Some Craig uh, stuff here. Sorry for the bad camera work, it's not so good. It's hard to do uh, best camera work when you're trying not to stick out too much and being told uh, to stop filming. Looking at these screwdrivers, these new Craftsman screwdrivers they have here. And they are made in Taiwan, so kind of disappointing on that. I think Sears still sells these that are made in the USA. Taiwan's better than China tools in my opinion, but like I'm kind of disappointed with the Craftsman, what Stanley Black & Decker did to it, sorta, like a lot of it's Chinese stuff. But some of it is USA, so at least you're trying. Got the metal uh, toolbox made in USA. More drills. This was 50 bucks 
for Black Friday, but now I think it's 69. So 49 on Black Friday, that was a good deal, 50 bucks. Be curious if they have uh, better sales again towards Christmas, who knows? Or, or do we miss the boat, guys? I don't know. Delta miter saw with stand. Almost half price, sort of. Tachi table saw with stand. That looks pretty, pretty badass. Two ninety nine. Tachi miter saw here. The Hitachi accorded tools are pretty good from what I hear. Walt, uh, is that a table saw? Some Bosch stuff here, some Bosch bits, laser uh, tools there. There's an employee right there, you see? Try not to get caught. Try not to make it look too obvious, you know what I mean? Laser tool here. Self uh, leveling laser. I think that's a new tool from Bosch. A lot of Bosch bits. Ten dollars. Some stores have these for two fifty, believe it or not. If you're lucky. On clearance. Craftsman power tools. Definitely Home Depot seems like they have more tool deals, a lot more tools going on than Lowe's. We got these uh, Craftsman tools on display, the drill driver and impact driver. That looks like a Porter Cable tool. It's rebranded. The V20. The Bosch Freak. This is the brushed model they just came out. It's like Bosch is coming out with the new cheaper priced power tools. 79 bucks. That's a that's a really good price until the 28th of November 2018. So you have like a day to act on that. Some Bosch 12 volt stuff brushed 99 bucks to the 28th it's a good deal to you Bosch uh, power tools are are good stuff it's a cobalt 24 volt little uh, end cap here so if you buy the the big combo kit 250 you get to choose a uh, one of these three tools, bear tools. That's a good price for 250. It only comes with one four amp hour battery, so that's the only thing. So you're gonna have to pick up some more batteries, but the batteries are not too much money. Draftsman uh, laser measure. Really, it's really small. I'm surprised how small it is. That thing's pretty cool. Perfect. 
these craftsmen uh, little socket kits look pretty cool craftsmen and mechanic socket kits the red ones are made in Taiwan the black kits are made in China Irwin tool over here clamps the Irwin clamps are pretty good some knives Leatherman multi tools craftsman shop back 40 bucks that's a good deal Lowe's is trying to compete with Home Depot on this shop back with the rigid I think they had one for 40 bucks as well 16 gallon a lot of DeWalt bits going on here. DeWalt oscillating tool, 99 bucks with a battery. Pretty good deal. I think that's brushless as well. More bits, saw blades. Like a million different types of DeWalt driver bit kits. Ten bucks to the twenty eighth. A lot of the stuff you see here with the white and red is to the twenty eighth, November twenty eighteen. Craftsman tools, flashlights, mechanic tool kits. A lot of craftsman stuff. Got a little section here, cobalt uh, bit kits. I like some of the cobalt bit kits, some of the certain ones that have useful things in it. They're not the, probably not the best quality, but they could be handy. This uh, fast ratcheting adjustable wrench. Uh, that's kind of like Cobalt's kind of good at coming out with this gimmicky stuff. I think it's uh, very likely to break though. Even I saw last year on display, there was one, uh, their display was broken. I don't know, is this blue one better? I don't know. It's like extra teeth on, on the end. That move. These are 10 bucks to the 28th. These kits here, these pliers and adjustable wrenches. 5 bucks for a knife, utility knife. Precision screwdriver, ratcheting screwdriver, three pack of utility knives, ten bucks. Scissors, five bucks. This is like a heavy duty scissor for seven bucks. It's like bits you put on your drill there, Allen keys. these are kind of good kind of like that long extension some of the cobalt uh, little drill kits there some of them have like a good combination of things black and decker stuff Cobalt stuff. Ratcheting wrenches. T 
T-Stack stuff. And they have this five foot fiberglass ladder here, 23 bucks to the 28th. That's a really good deal. All right guys, we'll see you next time. Wow.